Hello, um, welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope you're having a lovely day. Um, I am doing a highly requested, no, <laughs> not requested, but I am doing another lesbian romance novel review. That's what I'm doing today. I'm going to be talking about a very special author, one that I love so much. Just, I love her. Okay, her name's Erica Lee. I spoke about her a lot in my... I mean, I mentioned her a lot in the first lesbian romance novel. Um, I think it was Recommendations. Um, yeah, so I've read a number of her books. I'm going to go through some of them um, today, but I'm going to be talking about Anyone But Her, um, which is one of Erica Lee's books. Um, i am obviously got the iPad out. I'm going to read the little blurb first and then we'll get into it. Okay, so. Reagan Cooper has been an out and proud lesbian since high school, but can't say no when her gay best friend, Jamie Miller, asks her to pretend to be his girlfriend for his family reunion. Jamie has been there for, Jamie has been there for her through everything. Plus, she's interested in learning more about the family he never speaks of. And then, living in California for eight years, Charlie Miller, which is Jamie's sister, um, has been able to live authentically, but being back in her small Maryland hometown with her conservative family means going back into the closet. What she doesn't expect was to be so attracted to her brother's girlfriend. So, that's what it is. Here is what it looks like. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's the book. Um, it is one of my favourite books I've read. Um, it is, I just think, like, it is, you know, I spoke about this in my last, um, book review um that it is you know I I kind of like to see more of their relationship rather than leading up to their relationship and I think this has a really great balance of like um you know them before they get together and then you know after they get together um so and it, it's I think yeah there was definitely quite a, like close to the end um I was in tears a lot because, um, you know, her, just the whole thing about, you know, mentions her conservative, um, family and it's just heartbreaking, the, you know, unsupportiveness of, um, some family members. Yeah, I, I loved both the characters. I, I really connected, you know, to them a lot. And, um, yeah, I think it just takes you on a really cool journey that like you know I was sucked in I read it in probably a couple of days if not two or one or two days um and yeah I actually read this a while ago but I have forgotten to um do a book review on it because I, I think I read it before I started doing the book review so yeah um anyway I really love this book I recommend it so highly like if you're interested in this go and read it straight away um, and, yeah, go read that. It's, you know, amazing. Um, and now I'm going to talk a bit about the author I have on my laptop here. So, it says, Erica Lee finished writing her first book, Dear Santa, I'm Gay, in December 2016. Erica currently lives in Pennsylvania with her wife, dog, Chinchilla, and Bunny. Now, if you've read... I think it's Sunsets and Shades, one of her books. I absolutely love too. Um, one of the characters has a chinchilla. Now that seems that's pretty exciting. I love when like different things connect. You're like, oh my god, she's from there, and you know it's great. Anyway, um, it's uh, uh, and her bunny. She spends her days working as an optometrist and her nights snuggled up on the couch with her furry family, binging on Netflix or YouTube. Okay, so, um, that's basically it. I'm going to go through a list of the, um, of the books that I've read from hers, and 
I, yeah, I can't stress enough how much I really love her. Like, I think it, I will read any of her books, literally. Like, I don't even care about what it's about. Like, I will just read. I think that's a really good sign of a great author. So, yeah. Um, so, some of her books that I've read are Anyone But Her, Sunsets and Shades, Twice Upon a Time, Plus One, I just finished actually, um, Life Begins With You, find and Finding Home. There will be more reviews coming from books that I've read of hers, definitely in the future. Yeah, there's, I have a bit of a surprise. I think I'm going to upload it in a couple days. Another book review. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a surprise for anyone who... But first, go read. Go read anyone but her. Have to read that first. And then I have a bit of a surprise. So stay tuned for that. Um, this is a bit of a short review. Um, because I just... You know, I think... You know, trust me. It's, it's a good read. Like, you have to go read it. And, um... I can't, yeah, I don't really want to say much about it, um, because I don't want to really give it away, but, you know, obviously, in the blurb, it kind of said that, you know, there's these two best friends, they go to the guy's hometown, and, like, she, they're both gay, and she has to pretend to be his girlfriend because of his conservative family, and then, you know, Reagan meets Charlie, who, you know, it's obviously, Charlie's going back in the closet so pretending to be straight and um Reagan like immediately is like oh my god who's this beautiful girl and then Jamie the brother is like dude you're supposed to be my girlfriend like stop looking at her she's my sister she's straight like what are you doing um and you know and then plot twist go and read it <laughs> so I'm not gonna spoil it for you but um yeah I just I love it and I think you're gonna love it so go read it and um anyway um stay tuned for the next video uh please go like and subscribe it would mean a lot comment please comment more recommendations I am really wanting to hear some suggestions of what you've been reading and um yeah comment below you know I'm always trying to make these videos better I don't know if the short is like just reading the blurb and a bit about the um author or if you want me to go more in depth into the book and or you want me to talk more about how I felt reading it whatever it is please comment below it would really mean a lot so um I'm gonna go now but um hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you when I see you bye